So I want to talk to you about Sam and the process of creating a profile, a Sam profile for a speaker. So just some words of context. You know that our first product was the what what is called now Experts Amplifier, uh, first DVI product, and it's an, an all-in-one amplifier. So it gathers amplifier, pre-amplifier, uh, DAC, screamer, so it's an all-in-one product able to configure the, the expert product, the expert amplifier, to control perfectly the speaker that is plugged to it. Um, so what we do is actually taking measurements of each speaker on the market, at least the most common ones, and with those measurements, we are able to create a, what we call a SAM profile, um, and when this profile is read and is configured inside the amplifier, then the amplifier can adapt the signal perfectly to the characteristics of the speakers. SAM means speaker active matching, and it's actually an algorithm working in digital um, domain that is uh, running simulations uh, of the, in, in real time when music is playing. It's uh, computing the way the speaker will react to the music and the way the more precisely the way the membrane will move and uh, as we know exactly how the speaker will react how the membranes will move then we can adapt perfectly the signal inside the, um, the, um, the product before even before the amplification stage it's a um, time domain correction so it, it avoids phase and latency problems of frequency corrections and it's, um, it's an algorithm that um, enables the, 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 the membrane, the, the low frequency membranes, to be perfectly controlled. So we increase the precision of the signal. And as we know exactly how the speaker will react, we, we are also able to push it to its limits. To its Add limits. some base content. We can extend the frequency response of the speaker. So we can, it's not that we change the sound of the speaker, we don't want to change the sound of the speaker. Each speaker has its own signature coming from the manufacturer. We don't want to change that. We want to reveal the full bass potential of a speaker. And with Sam, we're able to do it. One point here that is really interesting is that we don't use any microphone. So we can do a profile wherever we want. We, da we don't need a special room, a uh, treated room. Uh, so we, we can do it wherever we want. And the second point, really interesting point, is that with this setup, we can create a profile for a speaker, a particular speaker, this one. But this model, this profile, will be, um, we will be able to use it on another speaker from the same model. So if someone went to 1000 hertz, and I'm measuring the response of the speaker. And I do it five times, and then I do a small kind of average to have a, a more precise um, measurement. We have the model. With those two measurements, we have the model. So the, the increase of precision, we don't have to do anything about it. It's done in the algorithm. What we choose is the frequency extension of the speaker that we want to put in the algorithm, depending on the maximal excursion of the driver. <laughs>